almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture perfect for a game. He's had a go! Oh, that's a waste. That's a throw. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Drives it towards the front. A long ball, but not especially accurate. Tony Kroos. Muniain attempts a clearance. And it's Tony Kroos. Tony Kroos. Casemiro. It's Casemiro! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Casemiro certainly caught it well enough, but that was never really going to trouble the keeper. And it's been taken straight back. Raul Garcia. Benyat. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Hit into the middle. Muniain passes it forward. Adjuris proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Adjuris. Adjuris with the cross. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. And here's Muniain. Could be thinking about a shot here. Tony Kroos. It is deadlocked. Raul Garcia. it out to the flank going through great run this he's covered quite a distance delivers across big chance it's in. and how about that for a volley executed to perfection oh look there's always a bit more satisfaction in executing a first time volley and he'll be buzzing inside after that Bilbao draw first blood here. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Now, Juris gets wrestled off the ball. Tries to locate someone up front. Good idea, just poorly executed. Looks to bypass the midfield. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. 
Modric. Tony Kroos. Lovely feet. Steered in. And it was always going to be the keepers. Yuri. Forward it goes. And here's Adjuris. That is terrific skill. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. Tony Kroos. And it's Isco. Knocks it away. Tries to get it forward quickly. It's Isco! That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Gets it upfield. Vinicius Junior. Isco. It's Isco! Well, that's confidence for you. This news doesn't even bother him. Runiain drives it forward. A really good feat. Casemiro and that's been well dealt with and the finish and in it goes they have hauled themselves right back into it Madrid produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch, and importantly, it is a strong end product. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked, and... Uh, I still haven't moved. Modric. Raul Garcia. Hoists it forward. Oh, he's not going to get that. Aran gets it away. Played out to the right. Kroos battles to win it back. Bilbao have a free kick. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning.
is a clever pass. And the half-time whistle goes. Well, it has been an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, we thought this would be close, Peter, and it's, it's proving us right so far. They're well matched, and it, it presents a, a fascinating battle of wits to see who will emerge on top or, or otherwise. Madrid head into the dressing room after a half in which we've seen two goals, one each, and the game right on edge. They're probably into the second 45 minutes. Madrid clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Up to meet it! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, as Tesco beat it, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. So a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Up towards the front line. Now it's Muni Ain. Raul Garcia. And here's Ajuris. Shoots! It's broken in for the follow-up. He can pounce on that. Oh, what a wonderful stop. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. decent attempt Peter and it's played forward goes direct to the front line right through the middle he's gone for it Big relief, it just needed better contact. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Vinicius Junior. Tries to get it clear. Raul Garcia. And it's played forward. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Garcia tries to get it forward quickly Raul Garcia drives it forward timely intervention well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there the movement was good but the pass lacked authority uh, a cause of mild frustration Goalkeeper's ball. Now a chance to break. Benyat drives it forward. Modric. Benyat hoists it forward and Juris pushes to get on the end of it as he picks him out looks to play him in That's, uh, a minor communications breakdown
Time for a change in personnel. Tony Kroos, Casemiro, Modric, now it's Aturis, defenders on the back foot, just brushed off the ball there, he gets past his man, now it's Aturis, Aturis, he's pulled off a fine save, the keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. More than... Oh, it's taken out. That'll be a foul. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. Nacho, Casemiro, Modric, Tony Kroos, and it's Nacho. Oh, he's supposed to get himself offside. Keeper sends it forward. Muniain. And here's Raul Garcia. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Well, he can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. Casemiro with the clearance. And it's Raul Garcia. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Nacho. Nacho with the cross. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Vinicius Junior. Forward it goes. One final crack at it now. Out to the right. He's got away. Macho goes looking. Isco into opposition territory. Vinicius Junior. Oh, too much weight on that. Madrid showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Well, that's where he wants it. Raul Garcia. Yuri. And here's Muniain. Tries to get it forward quickly. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Look, their supporters must be going barmy about this because there's no sense of purpose in what we're seeing. Comes the corner.
Madrid have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. And a shot! Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. Hoists it forward. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Well, nobody is totally satisfied, but it was a, a more than decent game, a super watch, and it ends in a draw. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Madrid certainly had some good moments, Peter. There were plenty of encouraging spells that more should have been made of. Just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day.